all our other tools. And here are the four Play-Doh that they provide for us. Let's start off by opening up all the bags. Here's our scooper. Here's one of our oven molds. This is our frosting maker. Here's another oven mold. Cool, another oven mold. And this is our last oven mold. We get two plates. And one spatula. Now let's open up our Play-Doh. We get one pink Play-Doh Plus. We get a yellow Play-Doh Plus. A green Play-Doh. and a blue Play-Doh. Before we start making some delicious desserts, let's set up our playset. Cool, that's the sound it makes when our baked goods are ready. We're almost ready to bake. Let's add our green Play-Doh into the base of the playset. We'll also add the blue Play-Doh as well. Now let's grab a scoop of our green Play-Doh and place it in our oven mold. We'll add one more scoop. Place it in the oven and watch what happens. Cool, that was fast. Turn it around to see what kind of cake we got. Yum, that looks good. We'll leave it on our plate for now. Now let's grab a scoop of our blue Play-Doh and place it in another oven mold. We'll throw in another scoop for this too. It's time to put it in the oven. Don't you love that sound? Oh, I can't wait to see what cake we have now. That's one delicious looking cake. Now let's mix our green and blue Play-Doh to make a cake. Mmm, that already looks good! That's a yummy looking cake! Now let's use this pink Play-Doh to make some frosting!
I like frosting, so we'll put on a lot. Yum, that looks really good. Now let's make some yellow frosting. Here's a green apple lemon cake, yum! This playset also has a lot of decorations for you to choose from. We'll add this onto our cake. Now let's make a pretzel. Mmm, that pretzel looks really good. Cool! We can even make a heart. And here are some more decorations to put onto our cake. Awesome! We hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to watch more Awesome Disney Toys. Thanks! Hey everyone! Awesome Disney Toys here, and today we're bringing you the Play-Doh Sweet Shop Candy Jar Playset. Here's the front of the box. Here's the side of the box with everything that they provide. And here's the back of the box. Let's begin by opening up the box. Let's pour out everything inside of the jar onto the table. Here we have a bone and gingerbread man mold, a star and cookie mold, two popsicle sticks, a heart and cookie mold, a cupcake mold, Two candy molds, a knife, a roller, another candy mold, and a cookie mold and a butterfly mold. And here's the cap of the jar that has a bunch of decorations for us to use. Let's start off by making a gingerbread man. Let's use the brown play-doh. Use the roller to flatten out the Play-Doh.
Now we have a gingerbread man. Let's place him on top of the plate. He's pretty plain, so let's give him some eyes. We'll use the blue Play-Doh. Now our gingerbread man can see. Let's use the red Play-Doh to give him a nice red smile. And to finish him off, we'll use the yellow Play-Doh to create some buttons. Now that's a handsome gingerbread man. We'll use this blue Play-Doh to make a cookie. Use the roller again to flatten out the Play-Doh. We have a yummy strawberry cupcake. Let's make one more cupcake. This time, we'll make a chocolate strawberry cupcake. Now that looks good. It's time to add some frosting to our cupcake. We'll use the yellow Play-Doh. We'll put it on top of our blueberry cupcake. Look at all that frosting! Now let's make some green frosting. How cool! We got some leftover yellow Play-Doh and it made a green and yellow frosting. Let's make another one. We'll put this on top of our chocolate cupcake.
Yum! Let's use the pink Play-Doh to make a heart. We'll use the blue Play-Doh to make a star. And let's use some of this brown Play-Doh to make a teddy bear. Isn't that cute? Let's place it on our cupcake. Look at all the delicious cupcakes we made. We hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to watch more awesome Disney toys. Hey everyone, Awesome Disney Toys here, and today we're bringing you Play-Doh Bakery Makeables. Here's the front of the box, and here's the back of the box. Let's begin by opening up the box. Here are all the Play-Doh that they provide for us. We also get one knife. And here are the instruction manuals to make three baked goods. Cool. Let's start off by making a cookie. Here are all the steps. We'll use this orange Play-Doh to make a cookie. Now that our cookie's ready, we'll use the purple and pink Play-Doh to make some chips. Mmm, yum! Doesn't that cookie look good? Now let's make a pie! Yum! Here are all the steps to make a pie! We'll use the yellow Play-Doh to make our crust. Let's use our purple and pink Play-Doh again to make our pie filling.
Mmm, the pie is starting to look really good. Let's top it off with some more crust. That's one delicious looking pie! Now let's make our cupcake! Here are all the steps to make our cupcake. We have to use this brown play-doh to make our cake. Let's roll out this white Play-Doh to make our frosting. Awesome! That's a lot of frosting! Now let's add a cherry on top! Now let's use the purple and pink Play-Doh to add some sprinkles! That's one yummy looking cupcake! We hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to watch more awesome Disney toys. One, thanks! Awesome Disney toys here! And today we're bringing you the Play-Doh Sweet Shop Double Desserts playset. Here's the front of the box. And here's the back of the box. Let's begin by opening up the box. This is the top of the oven. Here's our instruction manual. And here's the bottom part of the oven. This is the base of our playset. And here are all our other tools. Be sure to try out all the decorations. Yum! We hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to watch more. Thanks! Hey everyone! Awesome Disney Toys here, and today we're bringing you the Play-Doh Sweet Shop Flip and Frost Cookies. Here's the front of the box. And here's the back of the box. Let's begin by opening up the box. Here are the tools for the playset. One part of the playset. And this is the base of the playset.
here are the Play-Doh that we'll be using today. And this is the instruction for the playset. Before we can start making cookies, let's put this together. Let's take out our Play-Doh. Here's our white Play-Doh Plus. Our green Play-Doh. And our brown Play-Doh. Here's the frosting maker. This is a cookie mold. Another cookie mold. We can place our extra cookie molds onto this. plate with cookie molds on the bottom. To make cookies, you attach the mold onto the base of this playset and press down on the handle, like this. Let's use the brown Play-Doh to make our first cookie. Yum! Doesn't that look delicious? Let's use the white Play-Doh Plus to make some frosting. Mmm, that frosting looks yummy! Let's use the green Play-Doh to make another cookie. We'll use a different mold this time. Mmm, that's a good looking cookie. Let's top it off with some icing. Our two cookies look really good. Let's make some more cookies.
Yum, a chocolate cookie. That's a tasty looking mint cookie. Let's add frosting to make it better. You can even make a cookie sandwich. Now that looks really good. Let's decorate it to top it off. The base of this playset also provides a lot of decorations for you to choose from. We hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to watch more. Thanks. Hey everyone, Austin Disney Toys here, and today we'll be unboxing the Play-Doh Sweet Shop Cupcake Tower. Here's the front of the box, and here's the back of the box. Let's begin by opening up the box. Here are the five Play-Doh that they provide for us. Here's a piece to the playset. This is the base of the playset. A fork. Another piece to the playset and a plate. Here's our frosting maker, a knife, a spatula, plates and more pieces to the playset, and our cupcake tool. Before we start making some delicious cupcakes, Let's assemble our playset. We're almost ready to make some cupcakes. Let's take out the Play-Doh. We get a green Play-Doh Plus, a yellow Play-Doh Plus, a pink Play-Doh, a blue Play-Doh, and a brown Play-Doh. Let's use our brown Play-Doh to make our first cupcake.
Place the Play-Doh in the cupcake tool to make a perfect cupcake. We have ourselves a delicious chocolate cupcake. Let's place it on the plate for now. Now let's use the blue Play-Doh to make another cupcake. Mmm, blueberry cupcakes are my favorite. Let's use the pink Play-Doh to make another cupcake. Awesome Disney toys. Thanks! Hey everyone! Awesome Disney Toys here! And today we'll be introducing you to an awesome friend who'll be joining this channel! Don't worry! She's a lot of fun, so be sure to show her some love! Hey guys, good to see you again! I hope you're excited for our ice cream party, because today we're doing Play-Doh ice cream treats! Here's the front of the box, and it shows all of our accessories. And the back of the box, it shows different examples we can make. Let's get started! First, we have our ice cream scooper that also doubles as a sprinkle maker and our cone that also has stamps on them. Here's our ice cream cone stand. This also has stamps on it. And of course a spoon to eat our tasty treat. This bag comes with more accessories. Here's our Play-Doh. It comes in cream. Blue, pink, and orange. Let's open this up. Here's our Sunday cup. Can't wait to make a Sunday. And our Play Doh extruder. I think we should first start with pink. Let's use our ice cream scooper. And I want my strawberry ice cream to be in a cone. Perfect! Now let's do some vanilla sprinkles on top. We just place it in here and press it out. Let's stick on a lot of sprinkles. Do you guys like your ice cream with sprinkles? I sure do. I'm thinking we should mix some colors now. How do you guys feel about orange and strawberry together? Let's just mix it all together like this and put it into our extruder. Mmm, it looks like strawberry orange sorbet. I think it would go well with some blueberry ice cream on top.
Let's put one scoop of blueberry. Perfect. Now a little bit more orange. Two scoops. Just for fun, let's do a third scoop. That's a lot of ice cream. This looks like vanilla. Can't forget the sprinkles. How cool do those blue sprinkles look? Our orange ice cream needs sprinkles too. Yum, how good does that look? I like candy on mine. Let's add a gummy bear. How cute. Let's also add some gummy stars. Make a wish. The bottom of our stand also has stamps. Let's use some. Let's use this heart because we love ice cream. It isn't an ice cream without a cherry on top. How does that look? Let's put some more cream Play-Doh in here to make frosting on the top. Do you guys like frosting on top of your ice cream? If you do, give this video a thumbs up That looks so good. Just for fun, let's put a gumball on top. I hope you enjoyed this ice cream party. Please subscribe to see more. Thanks. Also, if you haven't done so already, be sure to follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. The links are in the description box below. Hey everyone, Awesome Disney Toys here, and today we're bringing you the perfect pop maker by Play-Doh Sweets Cafe. That was the front of the box, and this is the back of the box. Let's begin by opening up the box. The first thing we see are the four Play-Dohs that we'll be using. Here is the base of the pop maker. Here's the tower for the pop maker. Our popsicle molds. Here are some popsicle sticks. And another popsicle stick. This playset is very easy to assemble. All you have to do is place your tower on the base like this. Easy, right? Then you place the popsicle molds onto the tower. Now we're ready to make popsicles. Let's take out our Play-Doh. Here's our orange Play-Doh, our blue Play-Doh, our pink Play-Doh, and our white Play-Doh. We'll use the orange and the pink for our first popsicle.
Once you get your Play-Doh, mold it like this. Then grab a popsicle stick and place your Play-Doh on top of it. Then to finish it off, place it on the base and press down on the tower. Awesome! We made a really good looking popsicle. Now let's take off this popsicle mold and put the other one on. For this popsicle, we'll grab a blue Play-Doh and our white Play-Doh. Just like before, mold the two Play-Dohs together. Once it's ready, place it on top of the popsicle stick and put it on the base. Doesn't that look cool? Yum! We made ourselves a nice swirl popsicle. The base of the tower has many decorations for you to choose from. And here are a few of the decorations we created. You can place them on top of your popsicle like this.